What's up everyone, it's Kevin here, the Migraine Guy, bringing you a quick video update on melatonin. A recent survey was released from the Journal of Neurology, Neurosurgery, and Psychiatry uh, that showed that three milligrams of melatonin was slightly more effective at reducing by about 2.7 migraine days a month uh, your migraine frequency versus uh, placebo and 25 milligrams of amitriptyline. Uh, I've done a video on melatonin already, I'll put that right here. I've done a video on amitriptyline already and I'll put that link right here if you need to know more about that. But the interesting thing that this study showed was that melatonin, uh, easy to get, uh, over-the-counter supplement, uh, is as, if not slightly more effective than a uh, prescription strength medication uh, at preventing and reducing uh, migraine frequency and intensity. Uh, and this is above and beyond. Uh, I'll put a link to the uh, study in the description, the video description below. Um, but this uh, find is in addition to the sleep benefits you get from melatonin. People who don't get migraines uh, will very frequently take melatonin for its uh, uh, ability to help you get a good night's sleep. Um, and the study shows that while obviously getting a good night's sleep is helpful to preventing future migraines, that's not the only benefit um, that the body gets from increased levels of it. Uh, they don't exactly know what it is, but they know that they need to do more research. Uh, one of the you know slightly nice things to hear, uh, since amitriptyline uh, is a is a low dosage kind of not used so much anymore antidepressant. Uh, antidepressants typically work uh, in ways that help your body uh, store and hold on to fat, um, and so amitriptyline when you take it, uh, the study even discusses briefly that uh, participants saw weight gain, um, which if you're using amitriptyline to, to get rid of migraines, you, you might be you know, happy if it does work, but upset that you're gaining weight. Uh, whereas with melatonin, participants actually saw overall a net decrease in body weight. Um, so uh, the study is really just kind of heralding the benefits of, of melatonin. Uh, as a migraine patient, uh, melatonin should sound fantastic. Uh, it's inexpensive, over-the-counter. Uh, it's not something they have to worry too much about uh, in terms of side effects. Um, so yeah, find a good brand that you like, try it for a while and see if it helps. Uh, be sure to leave a comment below if your uh, experience is positive, negative, or indifferent. Be sure to hit the subscribe button so you get more information on my video updates. Uh, make sure to hit the like button if you like the video, and if you don't like it, just close the browser. See you later, guys.